What's going on, everybody? This is Al from PlaybookGamer.com. And in the last Dynasty video, we took on Oregon State, and it was a great top 25 matchup, a real defensive slugfest. We was able to come out on top. As you could tell, they were equally matched teams, but we just made a couple bigger plays towards the end, and we was able to pull off the victory. Now we've won 13 in a row. Of course, wins coming off the previous season. We are 6-0, and and today we are taking on Buffalo. We're 13th in the country. They are 1-5 and five with C overall talent. And it looks like they can pass the ball halfway decent, but that's kind of it. Today's in a very important day, and that is because of recruiting. You go to recruiting, and we got several guys visiting today. So I'm super excited to see if any of these will commit. Just looking, looks like we've stayed the same across the board. I know we have, oh, okay, this Neil Scales, he's ready to visit. I'm going to have him visit today as well. And we can look here, program prestige and academics. He doesn't care about either one. Since we are a three-star coach and program, we should, let's keep it uh, Tennessee, NC State. Um, I don't know what he likes. There's just no way of knowing. Let's go coach prestige. Once you become a three-star coach or a three-star program, you can start using the program and coach prestige a little bit more. So let's just play it safe and go coach prestige, but since he already doesn't like program prestige. Let's go here. We have Jimmy Castillo out of Maryville, NC State, and Notre Dame for this guy. He doesn't care about playing time nor coaching philosophy. So let's do, let's do program prestige just to keep it safe. Here we have Joseph Ward, the kid out of Minnesota, the quarterback. He's not excited about our program prestige, and academics aren't on his list. So it doesn't matter what we pick. It's not going to be right because you can't have a positive and a negative pitch for one prospect. So we're going to just take a chance, and we're going to go with coach prestige. Yeah, we'll go with coach prestige. Hopefully we win big enough, and he'll commit regardless. Next up, Keith Magruder. We are still in decent shape for this kid. Vernon Hines, he's visiting today as well. Let's see. He doesn't care about academics. He doesn't care about coaching style. And he doesn't care about playing time. So we'll just keep it safe and go program prestige. Virginia Tech and Michigan, both of those are very high up on the prestige. So we'll go with that. Quarterback Nick Whitaker, he's not ready to take a visit yet, but he's getting close. And another guy, Deion Brooks, he's ready to take a visit. So we're going to have him come today. No reason not to, and he is all about location. So we'll just go with him. We'll go with location there. And last but not least, Craig Harrell, wide receiver, Minnesota, Notre Dame for him. He doesn't care about coaching style nor about coach prestige. I could go location or uh, let's just do location. That, my gut tells me location. Let's just go location for him. So we have one... We got six guys, I think. One, two, three, four, five, and six. We got six guys visiting. Hopefully, we can get at least four of them after today. Should be a whole lot of fun. Make sure you stay at the end of the video for that. All right, let's go to Sports Illustrated. Bowl rankings. We are... You think we would be on here. There we are. This is the first time we've been in the BCS bowl rankings in the Dynasty. So, it's cool to see that. Top 25 polls, that doesn't matter at this point. You go to Heisman Watch. A couple Miami kids, NC State, Texas Tech, Virginia. Again, we're not going to have anybody on this list this year just because we're just splitting carries between Gladhar and Davidson. Go to Conference Standings. We can check out our team information screen. Of course, Harris is out for the rest of the year. Simmons, I'd love to see him at least get more touchdowns than interceptions this year. That may not be possible. We'll just see. I'm not going to force that. But Gladhar's having a great year. Davidson behind him. Look at the defensive stats. Potts, I think, if I'm not mistaken, it's been a few days since I've played the Dynasty. He had an amazing game against Oregon State. Just was all over the field. Mitchell is still leading in sacks with Schroeder leading in interceptions. Now we are taking on Buffalo. That is a max school. And they are all the way down here. And they got a quarterback out. I don't know if that's the starter. It may not be. 
just because it looks like the leader in quarter in passing is putting up decent numbers this year. So that may be just the backup. But they got an outside linebacker out for the season. Running the ball, they don't do much of that at all. And wide receiver, you're receiving, you can't really tell what's going on there. And looking at the defensive stuff, looks like they got three different guys doing damage on that front, same as us. So it'll be curious to see where all their impact players lie and uh, all that good stuff. So let's go, before we get into the game, I want to go to the playbook. I had a, a couple good discussions in the comment section of the last Dynasty video, and I think it's a good idea to add a little more spice to the offense instead of me just running, you know, slam and option speed and power option out of just nothing but ace and I. We're going to do a little bit more option from various sets. So if you wanted to see like a Heinz 57 of option football for instant play football 06, this is a way to do it. I pretty much have a couple formations for each of the main option oriented uh, concepts. I kept normal and slot in there. I added flex bone twins. That fits our roster pretty well. This is going to be one of the few times where I want Gladhar and Davidson in on the field at the same time. I think one of the reasons why our run game is so success successful is because both of those guys are taking breaths. You know, they're taking breathers when it comes to not having to be on the field all the time. So one goes in and another one comes out. That way one of them's always fresh. But this is going to be one of the few formations we'll do that. I'll sprinkle in a little triple option with this formation. But there's a couple. The reason I picked this uh, particular formation is because it's got three pass plays that I really like that's going to fit the offense fairly well. So we'll fool with that some today. I kept I normal and twins. I want to keep that I option look. Got to keep pro twins in there for Myers alone. I kept wishbone normal in there because that's I'm treating that as my goal line for this season. I kept two back slot in there, but then I added gun bunch. Now, I'm not going to use a whole lot of deep cross-up. We don't have the receivers to really do that. And you can't put a halfback in that particular slot without his ratings plummet. There's no four or a sub package for it. But I, I wanted to pick gun bunch because it's got three or four really good run plays I want to fool around with. Mainly, it's like the QB choice and off-tackle type stuff is what I wanted to fool with. So... Between Ace, Flexbone, Eye, a little pro, and Wishbone, and Gun, that's a lot of different ways to skin a cat, a la run the option. So hopefully that'll break up the monotony a little bit. It should be a whole lot of fun. Hopefully it works. And Audibles, I put some in here. Again, I just don't have to use these a whole lot. I just went with some deeper concepts, deeper plays from some of these formations. But I doubt I'll use much of them, to say the least. I just, I just don't have to. Okay, with that being said, let's go ahead and take on Buffalo. Take care of business today. Win big. Get some recruits, some commitments. That would be great. I'd love to get all six. I don't know if I've ever... I had a discussion with this with a good buddy of mine a few days ago. In his dynasty, he had six guys visit in one day. I don't... I think I've done that before. It's just been a long time. But that's a whole lot of kids coming for one day. No pressure, but it helps if you win that game. <laughs> Looks like they got another player out, suspended their fullback. Just been a bad year for Buffalo, to say the least. I like Buffalo. I, I think they got cool uniforms, a unique stadium and such. They're a fun little MAC team to play with if you want to run a dynasty with them. Something a little different. Recruiting will be a little tough. Not a whole lot of recruits up there. Got a pretty knife for some football. No complaints about the weather tonight as we see nothing but yeah, stars perfect. in this contest between the Buffalo Bulls and the Murray State Racers. Well, we hope you're as excited as we are for this one. Finally looks like the crowd is packed. The, the stands are at least. The racers are a confident bunch of kids, and rightfully so. Yeah, I like their uniforms. Oh, glad hard. Imagine how many yards he would have if it was just him and not Davidson helping him out. And they're picking us. That's expected. We won the toss. I want the ball in the second half. 
Yeah, I love those uniforms by Buffalo. They're way that they, they really pop. Okay, let's go to formation subs. I got to make sure this is correct. I want. Uh, no, I, I need Gladhar right there. Let's let's put Davidson here. I'm gonna leave that as is. We're gonna do the twin halfback look there. Yes, I'm okay with all of that. Yes, I'm okay with that. Here, I'm okay with that. I think we still... We're going to use that more for passing than anything else. So I want Myers in there. We're going to put Davidson here. And I think I'm okay with that. I think everybody's splitting carries pretty well on that front. All right, let's check out their roster. Quarterback. They got a dual threat guy. So I don't know how much blitzing I will do today. They got an impact halfback, so it's going to be interesting to see how well they run the ball. That tells me they're going to run the ball quite a bit. I hope I'm wrong on that, because they've been throwing the ball quite a bit. I'm just not really sure what they're going to do, but obviously we don't want him to run wild on us. Their fullback is out for the day. Nothing at wide receiver. Not a thing. So I'm getting, going back to their quarterback situation. Yeah, it's their backup who's out for a couple weeks. That's what I figured. Tight end, nothing to get excited about. Offensive line, 78, 70, nothing great at all. I did not do any scouting whatsoever. Um, we'll find out really quick what they like to do. Defensive end, 78, they may run a 3-4. That's a humongous defensive end. That is a 3-4 D end, but that doesn't mean they will run a 3-4. That's a big defensive tackle, too. One of the big ones you can find. They may run a 3-4, but they got a lot of defensive tackles. That tells me they at least run a four-man front. They're outside, left outside linebackers out for the year, but their backup, I mean, he's terrible, so that's not saying a whole lot. Middle linebackers, okay. Right outside linebackers, okay. Corner. Uh, let me look at their middle linebackers. Yeah, they don't have much of middle linebackers, so they may run a basic 4-3. You go to corners, 80, 76, and 74. Really good free safety. Well, technically not. He's just a 74 overall with 86 speed, but he's still an impact guy. So he'll he'll make a difference today somehow. And their strong safety is just the same, but without the impact status. And they got an impact kicker. Good. I'd rather have one of their impact guys be a special team guy who's never on the field. We'll take that any day of the week. It's that halfback we got to worry about. Should be interesting. The stats said they like to throw a lot, but their best player is their halfback, so we'll see how they handle that. And I can't do much blitzing because they're quarterback, so that's an interesting backfield that may give us some trouble. Yes, I meant to do that. Let's go with a 4-3, one high. Nope, not at all. Today we get to watch a spectacular athlete at running. Now let's do the under front. The field, as he is right now. If they do a lot of really to toss, then I may have to field. get out of that. And I really believe that he could have a huge game today. That makes two of us then. I just don't know if it's a good catch. Got the first, I think. Especially at linebacker to compete. So they passed out of the gate. Well, I guess we'll I'm still going to run uh one high. First and ten. Ball on the I don't trust him. They shift on the defensive line. They'll throw on first down. Ah, another good catch. So they're passing a lot. They may have it set up where they just want to pass quite a bit. So watch me go quarters and then they run the ball right here. Just long enough for him to find his target. And when you combine the two, it'll be a first down nine out of ten times. Drops back to pass. Rolls right. Throws this one. What in the world? Well, that was easy. Easiest touchdown ever. Easiest drive ever. That's your typical first drive for the opponent. Sometimes they just do everything just right and nothing you can do about it. Greco took a terrible angle on it. Well, that's not how you want to start. So they threw, through and they threw some more. Gosh, that kicker. I have a feeling we're not going to do much returns on kickoffs. I'm guessing he's going to boot this one in the end zone. There's no wind. Back ready to return. Here's the kick. 
I'm going to take it out, though. I was hoping for a hole, but there wasn't. So we lost five yards. Not a big deal. Oh, oh yes, I forgot. Let's go to formation subs, and let's look at the tight ends. I completely forgot about that. I want green in there. Here, I need Olsen. Olsen, Olsen. Green, I'm okay with that. Here, I want Olsen. And we're going to do the tight end sub package for this one. And green will be my number one guy there. Just because we don't have the receivers to do a lot of that stuff. So, okay. Let's do something basic first. Get in a bit of a groove we can before we start fooling around some other new things. We're going man shifting that way. We'll go this way. Get a block right there. There you go. Had to be a little patient on this one. I, I used a speed, but then I stopped just enough to let Myers get that extra block. So let's reward him if they go man. They're going zone. Go here. Nope, intercept. Ooh, that was stupid. Don't ever do that. <laughs> Don't ever do that. Not a smart pass. It was not a smart pass. I agree. Uh, let's do our tight end sub package. Let's do basic speed option from Gun Bunch. We're going zone 4-3. Uh, we're going to shift. We're going to go to the right. I just felt the need to keep that. Third and two. Let's go back to power options, see if we can pick up the first. We're in two down territory, so I may have to go for it. I'm just going to keep that. I think it was too cogged down. It was too crowded to pitch it to Gladhart. So speaking of, let's just hand him the ball. Then we'll do one of our newer things. We'll just do basic slam. Gladhart needs to touch it. So they're going man 4-3. And this is the fifth shifting like that. The racers go with the eye formation. He's coming down. On the ground, up the middle. Big opening. Gets past the tackler. Throws Good little the run ball. there. Where are we? We are on the big, big 20. Uh, let's go here. Let's do the twin half back. That defense starts to creep up a little bit. There we go. Let's do basic triple. It's first and ten. This is triple counter technically. They're going man. Spreading out like that. I'm still... We're going to go to our left. And I went the wrong way. I, I pitched to the wrong guy. Or painted it off. We can go back and look at this. I did not mean to hit the button. <laughs> you can obviously tell there's no hole right there. And this guy right here kind of stood still. So, I, I just goofed up. Thankfully, Gladhar didn't get tackled somehow. He just kind of broke that one right there and Went off for six points. Goofy little play, but we get the six points. <laughs> we'll kick an extra point. So we had no real issues moving the ball there. I'm just curious defensively. We're going to go back, I guess, do a lot of quarters, keep everything in front of us. I, I guess they're going to keep passing. Which I'm actually okay with as long as their impact halfback doesn't get the ball a whole lot. So we can... We'll just do quarters and see how they handle that. Now watch them run it. Oh, they're going to pass. Ooh. Bounced off a couple players. We'll stay in quarters. We're going to do a spy with Mitchell, just in case. And that was a good move. Good job, Al. So, let's go Cloud. And we're going to do the same defensive end spy. I still want to use my favorite play. I just want that spy over there just in case. 
Get him. All day to throw. That ain't good. Oh, he dropped him. That's fine. I did not want to take him over. I just didn't feel comfortable in that situation. So we'll take the break and have them drop it. That's one of the reasons why I'm not throwing at the meeting of my receivers this year, because we've had so many drops. Uh, we'll fair catch that when That guy's fixed to come right on through. We're in the middle of the field. Uh, let's go. I want to go here. Let's do QB choice. They're going zone nickel. Let's get up to the line and see what they do. Ooh, I like that. Let's just hand this off. Ooh, they went blitz. It's a good call. They were blitzing from the right side. If he wasn't blitzing, I would have went to the outside, but I had to cut back in. We are there. Let's go. Uh, let's see. Let's do speed option. We haven't called that yet. They're going man 5 2. A crunched up 5 2. Um, let's go to the right. Get a block right there. Nope, ain't going to do it. Let's just get out of bands. I don't We don't need our quarterback getting hit. Not if we can help it. Right hash again. He cuts up the field and keeps the ball himself. Nope. I'm trying to think. We got post divide. Let's no, I'm gonna wait there. That's a good left hash play. Um let's do basic fullback option. Zone four three. I may end up cutting this up the middle here. That's good defense. I couldn't cut up quick enough. Let's do a basic option again. Different formation. 4-3, man. Let's see how they shift. That's okay. We'll go to the left. Get first down. First down. Just enough. Woo! Good yardage, crazy play down. right there. Crazy, crazy play. Let's try. It was on my mind. Let's do this PA boot right. We're going zone. This will be interesting. This will be more of like one of my RPRs. This is great man beater, but let's do... Let's see what we can do against zone. Let's see who's open. Go to Olsen. He was open a lot earlier than that. Let's see if we can get a good instant replay. Eh, it's not the best in the world. I'm surprised he caught it. That's not what he's known for. We can go back and look at this. Uh, I would draw this out, but I don't think... The biggest thing is I have a couple reads against zone. I have this guy going like this, and I got this guy going out like this. And I'm just going to roll out, and I'm just reading this corner right here and seeing what happens. And whoever can get open, that's who I'm going to throw to. Well, what happened was... My tight end is the one who had was more open. Like he was wide open right here, still kind of open, still kind of open. And while I'm still running over here, yes, I could run with the quarterback, but this guy right here was going to stop it. But I was looking at this guy, this guy, but you can tell none of them were really open. So I just took the chance and went with Olsen, and it worked out to say the least. So we're on the nine yard line. Let's go. Let's go slot corner. They're going man. Good. Oh, I want to see Myers get a touchdown. The racers line up in a split back set. Simmons back to throw. Throws no, he's going to get in. Complete. Oh, he got in. I didn't know what was going to happen there. I thought he was going to get caught. Atta boy, big 37. Good to see him get to touch the ball. They actually had good defense. They were just not fast enough to get over there to make a play. So we got our first lead and Buffalo is still passing the ball. On two straight drives, they haven't ran it once and the quarterback hasn't even taken it off with it yet. And he hits the, PAT. Uh, the one run that they, had, that they did have was a draw. Is that what it was? Or a direct maybe? Yeah, they had one run play and we stopped it, stopped it with the QB spy. Do another high kick. 
I'll just keep doing zones if they're going to throw that much. I would love to blitz, but I'm not a big fan of like the cover three blitzes in here. Going with another draw. Picks up about three or four. We'll just stay in the same play. It's second down and six to go. Ball on their own 38. They'll work from the shotgun. Gun wide trips. Back to pass. He steps up. Short toss. And it's caught. I'm glad I took Abdullah over. I don't know if he would have made that tackle if I'd have picked him up. Third and three. They're... We'll go 4-4, I guess. They're going with a big set. Great stop. Somebody came through. They ran the counter play, which wasn't the best selection in the world. That's why I normally don't call them in this game. Very few of them work halfway decent. So we can get the ball back here. Uh, we can get some yards on this one, I think. Long takes it Ooh, man. Thanks All right, we're on the left hash. On the last drive, the let's try. I have it on my mind. So let's just go with two quick slants. We're going zone. I was hoping they'd go man. They're spreading out. This will go to Anderson or Green. Get a block right there. Oh, just don't. Mm. Man, if we had a block right there, they ended up being a really good play. I don't know if him having to come back for it helped. A great block right there by Green. Oh, Clark just missed out on that one. So right hash. Let's go. Let's go back here. Let's run basic triple. We're going man. I'm going to hurry up to the line if I can. Ooh, big shift. Uh, that's good play. I, I, you're supposed to hand it off right there because of this guy. I just read it wrong. Glad Har had a huge hole right there. He was going to get mad by an impact player, but that's a good call. That's my bad. That's the end of the quarter. We'll see if we can do a better job of that next time. I want to stay here, though. We done post divide. No, we didn't. Right, let's do post divide. All right, they're going man. You got a couple man beaters here. Clark over the top or Olsen. That's, I forgot Olsen. Well, he made a good catch last time. Yeah, I should have known better. I should have known better. On the 48. Go deep outs. They're going man. I'm passing too much. I should have known better. Let's see what happens here. Cover two. Great catch, Johnson. Good throw, too. I had my feet set. You can go back and look at this. Good clean pocket. Just a great throw. So now let's run the ball a little bit, shall we? Let's go here. Let's do the halfback option. They're going zone 4-3. It's a full house backfield. On the ground, the tailback. This guy came right on through. Myers couldn't block him. I could have pitched it right there, and I just was a little too late on it. I don't care how good an athlete you are. My bad, my bad. You're not going to be able to showcase your abilities without some blocking. Go power option. Let's see if we can make up some of that. They're going man. Huge shift to the right. So we will definitely go to the left. Bring that guy over. Yeah, good blocking all around. Somehow he got through that. <laughs> Don't know what happened there. That was pretty wild. He just nudged into him. Crazy. So we're like on the 19-yard line. Let's go back. I'm going to go here. Let's see if I can redeem myself. You also have the triple wide receiver option, but that doesn't really fit with our roster. Let's go back to triple. Let's see if I can do a better job of it. They're going man 4-3. It's been forever since I've ran triple. We're definitely going to go to the right. Their last trip down here was a success. Let's see if this one... Oh, much better read there. He is gas. I'm just going to go ahead and hand that the ball. Or pitch it to Davidson. You can tell Simmons was slow as can be right here. 
Like he just like, uh, just a slow crawl. We're on the nine yard line. Let's just hand it off to Gladhar. Zone four three. We're gonna I'm gonna leave that as he is. Get a block right there. Yep, six points. Good deal. Give him a a second touchdown. Now we're starting to impose our will on him. Offensively, it's not much of a struggle. I can just tell it's we're not having too many issues. I'm having more issues with myself than I am the defense. We'll get back on defense. See if we can do some damage there. Do another high kick. I really want to. If I can find me a better kicker, I will. The problem is, once you already have a kicker on the team coming back, it's hard to find another one that wants to come play for you. They are going with that. Okay. My quarters looks really weird with this look, but we go He's wide open. Wow, good play. Wide open. I like the defense that was called. Okay, they're going with that. I'm still going to go with the quarters at a 4-3. The they said they was going one wide receiver, but apparently not. I made the tackle. It was kind of goofy looking, but I made him roll into me. It's second down and four to go. Ball on the 45-yard line. They line up in the shotgun. I'm ready for this quarterback to goof up and throw it my direction. Drops back to pass. Steps up. Look. Like that. Ah, oh, so close. So close. So it's third and four. What we're going to do, we're going to go cloud. We're going to do our spy with our defensive end. Just in case. They come out in a nickel. And I made the stop. They ran the ball. Fourth and inches. I'm going to take a chance, and we're going to go with our pump block. With the all-out block. Hopefully they do not fake it. This, only that, this works great for punt returns, punt safety return type situation. Thankfully, okay, they're going with a tight punt. That's a great kick. Oh, it's going to get in the end zone. I thought that was super close getting like down to the one. Right middle of the field. Normally I'd like to go with the deep cross up. I really don't want to. Let's go back to QB choice. They're going man dime. Hmm. I have the numbers. Hmm. Let's go. Let's bring this guy over. Go here and good little play here. Um I brought, they went man, I brought my tight end over to get an extra body on that side. Oh, I was already determined to ha to keep it with the quarterback. And just great blocking my tackle. No, that's not my tackle. Who was that? That's one of my receivers? Oh, yeah, that was green. I'm an idiot. Either way, good block by green. He's probably the reason why that was a successful play. Problem is, Simmons just doesn't have a good top end speed. It's only at 80. But we was able to get some yards out of it. I should have ran out of bounds instead of doing what I've done right there. Still a good play, though. Okay, let's go. Let's do option. Slot, get glad hard. Then we'll get Davidson going a little bit. They're going man 4-3. Let's bring Johnson over. Good pitch right at the last second. Tough. Kid's tough. What a ball player. He's not a drummer. Drummer's a different type of running back, but this guy is just stronger. Can break an extra tackle or two. Let's do basic slam. 
with Davidson. Get him going a little bit. Get Gladhar a bit of a rest. They're going zone 4 3. They're doing that. We'll, we'll probably go to our right. Be very patient here. I love it when they go zone. Gives you a chance to go up the gut a little bit more often than usual. I saw a big hole up the B gap. I guess that, yeah, that's the B gap. Look at that killer block by our right guard. And then I'm just kind of waiting. Who's going to pick up a block? Anderson does a good job on the safety. And we get an easy, what, 15 yards? Not a bad play at all. So where are we? We're on the 38. Now's a perfect time if we can. i tell you what I need to do. I need a call. I should have known this before. For my audibles, I should have ran something like... I need to put this in here. Anytime I see zone, when I call RB clear out, I need to go with a tight end corner. Let's do that. I don't know if it'll pick it up or not. We'll see. We're going to try it. All right, they're going man, so I don't have to call it. I'll do that after the game because your audibles don't set unless you're outside of the game itself. Let's see, R1. Looks like that linebacker is on him. I threw that one kind of hard. Ah, oh, he dropped it. I think he got hit when he... They went cover one, but that guy was pretty far off away from him. He's going to see the film tomorrow and be kicking himself for letting that one slip through his hands. So they got a drop, we got a drop. So tit for tat. All right, they're going zone 4-3. Probably don't need to call this on a second and ten. We're going basic triple. We're gonna go to our right though. Uh, let's look at this. That's the reason why I handed it off to him because this guy was blitzing. So I probably done that correctly. I think Buffalo just played this one really well. Yeah, that was smart on my part. That's who I was looking at. So it is what. Third and five. Let's let our best players handle this. Let's go power option. Man four three. This is the sixth play of this drive. Ooh, they're doing that. This defense is I guess we'll go right. Just get the first, just enough. So we're on the twenty-five yard line. Looking at Gladhart, Simmons, Davidson. Davidson needs to touch the ball a little bit more. Let's do a toss with Davidson. I feel like Simmons is a little bit gassed, but I want Davidson to touch it. We can leave it as is. And get about four yards. Not a whole lot. Let's go RB deep. We're going zone. Kind of need to get with it. Great little play. It wasn't a very good throw. He had to come back for it. That was just my basic zone beater. Good little cut up. If I would have used a speed button, I wouldn't be able to cut as sharp as I did. So we're like on the, what, nine-yard line again. Let's go quick slants. We're going zone. We're going to let this clock roll. I have no need to hurry up here so we can run some clock before half. This will go to Green or to Johnson again. Really good defense. Somebody came through. Yeah, that left tackle got blown up. I think a lot of had me do. I kept backing up. I wish, there's one thing I can point out. When you go to settings and you go to, uh, no, it's right here, controller settings. I wish there was the option where it would not auto pass if you just leave it alone. Like as soon as you snap the ball, the quarterback is supposed to drop back precisely like he's supposed to for that given play. The problem is in 06, he will still pass automatically. I think they changed that in 07 going forward. I wish it was in. Otherwise, I would let him do the perfect drop back, and I wouldn't have to worry about that. That way you won't see your, you know, your lineman get beat up as bad on some of those plays. I didn't get in. I didn't know what was expected there. That guy ended up more getting hurt. 35 seconds. Third and goal. Third and goal. 
Let's go basic power. They're going zone 4-3. Or not 4-3, they're going goal line. But the clock has stopped. We'll just go here, get a block right there, get six points. All right. So we got a good lead up three scores. Let's get through these next 32 seconds, and we'll get back on offense start of the third quarter. Kick an extra point. And we'll get back on defense. 11 plays, 80 yards. Took us a little while to get down the field, but we got there. And I went with a basic kick. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> They'll probably score a touchdown here. Get a stop, somebody. There you go. I forgot to do the high kick. And my kicker's hurt. <laughs> His shoulder, that ain't good. I hope you're right, Kurt. All right. I, I don't know what they're going to try to do here. Let's go basic quarters. Just keep it neutral. They may just run the ball. I don't know. Yeah, they're going to run the ball. Just nothing going there. I don't know if they're going to snap it again. In this case, I would always want to go for like that A gap. And a fumble. Oh, well. Okay, six seconds. Can we get... Uh, let's go. I, I hope... Mm, we can try. Let's go deep bounce. Six seconds. This is kind of a long play. I don't know if we can get a touchdown. It just... It, we'll find out. Oh, good defense. Two seconds. Let's just call it again. I think the game is over with. I really don't want to kick a field goal. So let's just call it again. Plus our kicker's out. <laughs> we don't have a kicker. There we go. Much better. Had a very soft zone against me. I could have thrown it. We can go back and look at this. A lot of times, you don't have to wait until the post makes his cut. Sometimes you can hit him like right here. And as you notice, if I can back out, notice the big hole right here. I mean, just humongous hole. So I could have threw it really hard right here. But problem is, I think this guy would have picked him up. And I noticed they was going cover two. So it just made sense just to wait until he was open right around through here. As soon as he made his cut, basically, I can throw it to him. I was actually a little bit late on it, but actually ended up being a perfect throw. Good timing on everything. Okay. The good news is, if we can get, I'm going to let my first string offense stay out there for one more drive. Get a touchdown there. And then I'll just put in my second string. And my kicker's back out there, thankfully. It has been total dominance. Ever since that first drive where everything just went right for them, they haven't been able to do anything since. Just, they're not a very good team. They're one to five. You know, what do you expect? And they've had players out and such. We've done good on the turnover front. That's what I care about more than anything else. We don't really care about the time of possession, even though we're winning that. That wasn't what I was trying to go for. Looking at the individual stats, I threw the ball a whole lot more in the first half than expected, but he done okay. Two touchdowns. He probably had that. He should have had one pick. But running the ball, just looking at the distribution, eight, eight, and six. Simmons, I, I try not to force that. But with Gladhart and Davidson, I'm happy with all of that right there. Unfortunately, Davidson just hasn't been able to get really going. But he will play a little bit more in the second half when I get Gladhart out there. Replace him the with Long or whoever. That's a kick and a half right there. No, we may have a chance. We can get some decent blocking. Let's see. And not a bad gain. Right hash. 
what have we called? I feel like we're missing. Let's look. Um, let's go back to QB choice. We're going zone four three. Don't shift hard to the right. Uh, okay. I had great play by that defensive end. That guy just annihilated Green right there. That was all him. That's just good play by the defensive end. We're on the right hash steal. Let's see if we can make up some of that. Let's go back to RB clear out. We're going zone, so what we're going to do is go to our play. I already forgot which button it was. It is L1, okay? The racers line up at a split so this is probably going to go to Anderson or Myers. Drops back to pass. Down the Ooh, that's a yeah, good play right there. Somebody got caught up. I was not expecting this guy right here, but I saw a huge hole right here. That's why I was going to go to Anderson. But that guy was sitting right there. We're very fortunate I didn't get picked off. Good defense. Now I have no choice but to do our third and long play. We're going man. I don't know if Ander if he can make this throw. This is going to be a tough one. I didn't get it. I may go for it. And that brings up fourth down. Great I went with a medium pass on that one. Hopefully it would go over the line, but he still didn't. He still had to come back for it. Oh, the hell is that not a first down? That is so close. Ah. Fourth and inches. I'm going for it because I don't care. The game is over with. Going go on. What in the world are they doing? The racers go with the I formation. Murray State. Wasn't expecting that. I guess we'll... Uh, geez, let's just punt it. I wasn't expecting go on. Maybe because it's a fourth and inch situation. We'll just punt it. Why they're down right now as we start the third quarter. He's the workhorse on this team. And if he's having a hard time getting yards... Fair catch that, if you don't mind. For this offense. Personally, I don't think he's had enough carries. The offensive coordinator... We'll go back to quarters. Call more plays that put the ball in the hands of your best player. Give this kid Back to ace normal they go. I promise you, he'll break one all the way. Well, this is the... He tosses it short. Ah. Goes on the run. Trader brings him Good play. Down. So hard to see what's happening on the other side trying to stop that quarterback. It's second down and two to go. We'll do nickel quarters this time. They keep it on the ground on the tail. Ah, he got out of it. Wow, what a play. To the 20. Huge play. And that was an outstanding run by that I took a bad angle with that doula earlier. He had good blocking after that, though. First and ten. They're inside the 20. I'm surprised they're not handing the ball over to him more. Murray State brings in the nickel here. Handoff up the middle. You move. Ah. With a take I, I made the tackle. It didn't look it, but <laughs> I think I made the tackle. Looks like they're running the ball now. Now watch him go play action off this cover one high. The D line shifts over. That's an odd looking setup right there. Ah, he, they're breaking tackles. First and goal. Let's just go. They're probably going to score. Let's just do a fire two. They line up in the shotgun. They may just go half back direct right here. Back to pass. Steps up in the pocket. Throw short. Good defense. The pass was knocked down. This defense is second and goal. And they swarmed to the football. I'm gonna do a zone blitz. To disrupt the passing game. Just to go after him. And this impact linebacker is fired up down there. Well, gets the well, six points. I figured they was going to score regardless. You could just kind of tell that drive. They were determined to score. So that drops it down to three score lead. That was a 14-point swing right there. 
And he hits the PAT. Here's the drive stuff. Looks like our first string is going to stay out there a little bit longer. Buffalo. Like to get a nice clean drive here, get that touchdown back. Nice kick, plenty of distance. Let's see if Long can do something with this one. Long fields it in the end zone. Ah. Nobody picked up that one guy. Let's do a basic option from ace normal. They're going dime. Going man. They're doing that. So if I move this guy over, what happens? Yes, that's what I want to see right there. That looked kind of rough. Right guard got beat badly. Big gain right there. Let's see if we can get a good replay. Yeah, my right guard got pushed back big time. Pitch at the last second got us a few more yards. I want to go back. I want to try to get Myers going if I can. They're going man. We may have a chance here. I'd love to see him go cover zero. We haven't seen cover zero against this play in a long time. They line up with split backs. He drops back. Let's it fly. Cover zero. Nice. Big play. We finally saw cover zero on it. They've been calling cover one or zone a lot of these teams since. I, I can't do the last time we saw it. But good to see Myers get another big play right there. Good catch. We're like on the seven-yard line. Let's go. Ooh, don't do anything goofy here, Al. Let's just, let's just get a touchdown. We'll go basic option here. They're going man 4-3. I like the shift. Ooh, that's... Mm. I couldn't cut up field. They just had too much speed, and my entire left side of the line got beat down big time. So, I mean, kudos to them. That was just a good stop. Don't pitch in that situation. I didn't, I didn't have to pitch there, and I did. Really dumb move on my part. We're going to go halfback power. We're going zone 4-3. We're going to go to our left. The racers with a full hop back field. They keep it on the ground with a tailback. Oh my gosh, he got in. <laughs> I don't know how. We can check the replay. He somehow got in. Just barely, like at the last second. Let's see if we can go here. If we can see it, we'll have to put our cursor like right here. Just right there is where he got it. You can't really see it, but he got in somehow. Just enough. Barely scraped the white line. Pretty cool to see that, though. That would actually be a pretty decent thumbnail. <laughs> pretty cool. Okay, we got the touchdown back. See if we can get back on defense and try not to goof up again. They tore us up. And he tacks on the extra point. And just over two minutes left here in the third. The score this time I'll high State kick it. 42, Buffalo 14. Murray State is ready to kick it away. There's a ton of time left in this game. And I'm glad I high kicked it. it. Otherwise, that was going to go out of bounds and we was going to get a flag. Uh, let's just do quarters. Maybe they're determined to run it. I don't know. Their play call has been pretty good the last couple of drives. I'm not really sure what to expect. Play action. Somebody intercept that. Ah, somebody should have took care of that. Overthrew it. And that's something he's been working very hard with his coach on. They come out with a big set. Counter. Somebody get a stop. All right, it's third and seven-ish. So what we're going to do is we're going to go cloud. We're going to do our spy look. I'll do a video on that sometime. Buffalo lines up with three receivers. 
Good defense. Potts was just sitting there waiting on it. I got beat badly. I was deep the defensive tank on. Did not help matters whatsoever. If you don't time it just right, you're going to get beat back pretty easily. The Bulls are lining up to punt it away. Robinson punts it, and it's a good We may have a chance to do something. Get a block right there. Takes it to 14. Get some yards, not a whole lot. Let's go. We can try this. This could be a left or a right hash, but it's on my mind, so we're going to call it. We're going to PA boot, right? Go man, go man. Ah, they're going zone. So I don't know what to expect here. Ugh, that shift is terrible. Nobody's open. Ah. Wasn't expecting to get hit. That's good defense. Uh, second and seven. Let's do speed option. Zone 4-3. We're doing that. The racers come out in the ace formation. Here's the option. Pitches back. That's good defense. And somebody done something. Let's check it out. Holding. It's not what you want. Second and 15. So where are we? I don't know where we're at. Let's do a basic option just to be... We're still on the left hash. Okay. I wasn't sure how they was going to do that. Man, 4-3. Let's see if we can make up some of that. Looks like we're going cover zero. Get a block right there. Wow, great defense. But that guy, that guy just bypassed me. If I'd have known that, I would have kept it. I could have swore he was going to go after the quarterback right here. Nope, he was determined. I should have faked it. We still didn't get the first. So it's third and inches. Let's go basic slam. See if Davidson can handle it. Where do you go? Uh, ah. I didn't. I was too impatient. Too impatient on that one. My bad. My bad. That's probably going to be six points. All right, let's try triple. We're going with zone 4 3. Ugh, jeez. I guess we're going to go to our left. Here, where it's kind of hard to see who to read. They'll run the option. Broke away from one. He has some room. And they make the I'm reading that defensive or the outside linebacker right there, and he got beat. That's a tough read. You know, I don't know if it's best to kind of keep it there and pitch and go with it with Davidson. Who knows? But thankful Gladhard just broke the tackle and made a play out of it regardless. Good run. Incredible effort there running the football by this guy. Let's go. Uh, we could try that QB. Uh, let's do speed option from the gun. First and ten. Zone 4-3. Ooh. From the gun. Simmons. The That's good defense. I had no chance on either side. Second and ten. We're going zone four three here. I think I'm gonna let that clock roll. I'm not a big fan of any of that shit. They went with my under front, so we're gonna let that clock go. This is the last drive for the first string. I probably don't even have him in there. With the score, Murray State. Uh, I got to know. Uh, let's do this. I'm I'm in the groove for it. Let's go QB screen. This is our little trick play. We're going man. Since they're going man, what I'm going to do is just keep it with the halfback. It's just going to be easier. Even if they are going cover zero. It's just easier if you just let Gladhart handle it. And we may get six points out of it. Oh, so close. Nice little trick play. My man beater, again, it's just easier if you just keep it with the halfback. Otherwise, I was going to... I can break that down for you. This isn't a good showing of it because I had to motion somebody over. But if they was going man or a zone, I was going to motion 
Anderson over. He's doing a slant. I was going to bring him over here, and he was going to do the slant over here. And by the time the halfback gets the ball, normally this defender, the corner, wherever he's at, would be like right here, and he would be coming after the halfback, leaving the slant wide open over here. If I can try to remind myself, we can do that again. Hopefully we'll see it again zone, and you'll see what happens in that situation. All right, they're going man. We're on the right hash, aren't we? Let's go. Let's go back to Myers if they go man. And they're going man. The Myers doesn't get the touch it much, but when he does, he makes an impact. Or at least we're going to try to. They're going that. He may not get in. Yeah, he's going to get in. Exact same one we had before on that first touchdown. So good to see Myers have his biggest game of the season. He hasn't got to touch the ball as much as last year. And with that being said, let's put in our second string across the board. And we got to stick to two wide sets going forward because we don't have the wide receivers to keep in there for backup purposes. And he hits the PAT. Time to take a look at the Pontiac. And uh, I'm curious. Oh, yeah, we need to switch out the halfbacks because we got formation subs. We need to put Davidson, uh, Williams, or Long. Let's do Long and then Williams here. That's fine. You're still going to see Davidson like out there because of those formation subs. And we got to stick to a basic 4-3 on defense because we don't have the corners for the mass sub situation. They still got their speedy quarterback out there. That's another thing. You haven't seen him run once all day. That's a halfback replay. Never works. Let's just stick with quarters. Second and nine coming up here. Ball on the 38-yard line. Number three. Well, at least our depth is getting a little bit better. It's still nowhere near where it needs to be. Going with P.A. Reed there. Our backups may have a hard time against this guy. I'll stay in quarters. Over 500 yards of offense. Pretty cool. Over the top. You know you're having a good day when you're getting 500 yards going. And there goes their halfback. That's actually like their fullback, if I'm not mistaken. Now they're determined to run the ball. So let's go with a one high. They need to get him some more carries. Buffalo comes to the line. Only one man in the backfield. Ooh, he dropped it. We'll take it. Oh, he could have had a big had him beat on that zig in or that whip in look. We'll go quarters. It's second down and ten to go. And this is the fifth play of the current drive. Drops back to pass. There we go. Somebody make a play. Ah, good block. Another huge gain. He had a whole lot of room to run on that one. When the pressure is coming from the inside and the quarterback can escape. That's the first time he's ran with it today, if I'm not mistaken. Buffalo goes with the ace set here. We'll stay and I don't know what I'm doing in quarters. I'd very good chance they're gonna run it. Play action. Nice play fake. Looking across the middle. Big play. At a boy, Al. It's got right in front of it. Just been outplayed and outcoached out there. Today. Anything, Hopefully that knocks that quarterback out for the rest of the game. There's not much else you can do except pack it up and try again. That may be a good thumbnail right there. Put myself on there. Just got right in front of that little flat route. So we're on the right hash. Uh, let's try. There's a play I rarely call. Halfback tackle. It's a little bit slow. But if the blocking's there, it's not too bad. The shift's okay. We can go to the left. Had somebody came right on through. 
That blitz couldn't have worked any Yeah, he just beat my center. Worse for the offense. Let's do a toss play. It's second down and We're kind of close to the, the back end, aren't we? I just now realized that. Murray State sets up in the eye. Ooh, I may do it like that then. That helped a little bit. That was a... Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Look at this. This is crazy. I don't know. Everybody and their brother got beat. I mean, just big time. Somehow he got that ball through there. He pitched it over everybody's head. The perfect pitch. Wow. I mean, what do you say about that? I don't think I've ever seen something like that before. He pitched over three guys' heads. Look at that. Over three of them. Goofy play. We'll just whatever. Uh, we got to stick to the two eye sets, don't we? And we don't have. We can go here. Maybe. Let's go fullback trap. I still got the twin halfback look in here, so it should be. I don't know who's back there. Long. Okay. We're going to run to our left. If that clock runs some. Um... Nope. Good defense. Somebody came right on through. Look at that. The blitz just threw off their blocking assignments. And that's why this running back is looking for Let's just do another toss. It's second down and 11 to go. We're just killing time at this point. Zero. They're going 4 3 zone. That's a good shifting right there. If I do this again, we can do that same situation we had last time. I'm curious to see what's going to happen. <laughs> Can you make that pitch again? Nope. And, and we're very fortunate. <laughs> well, I shouldn't have pitched it there. Everybody and their brother got beat big time. Even my fullback. It just it was bad all around. Don't know why I was doing pitching it there. They are very, very fortunate to get that one back. They sure are. That one has written all over What are we gonna call? Let's go flanker special. They're going zone, and I forgot. I bet I got Olsen back here. Yeah, he ain't going to make this play. He's too slow. We can try it. Oh, my gosh, he made the play. Wow. Oh, and he's hurt. Injured his leg. But what do you do? You know, just, he's your backup. So now I'm out of tight ends. Um. Uh, okay, let's just take a knee going forward. Hopefully, it's not serious. I mean, he's a big, you know, you know, big important player to our offense. He's our lead blocker on the edge. If he's hurt, that makes things a little bit more interesting, and not in a good way. But he injured his leg, and the announcer said it didn't sound too good. And they're usually right on those things. But that last play where he made that first down, that was your simple go post, but out of a different look, out of gun bunch. I'm surprised he made the play. I thought he wasn't fast enough to get open. And he'll just kneel it here. And I need to... Ooh, he's back. Yes, he's back. Thank the Lord. He's not hurt. Good. He's out there. The reason why I'm running this is... Oh, okay. Yeah, we're running it. I didn't know if I was going to have enough time. They was going to call a timeout like a second left. So I can just pitch this along and be done with it. It The clocks are dead in sync with each other. Whoop. Bring him down. All right, game over. Make sure you stay around to the end of the video. Let's see if we get some commitments. We can get out of here. Let's see. That was a lot of fun. Got to introduce a few new things just to break it up a little bit. I'm sure you guys are pretty happy with that. That we don't have to see Ace and I all the time. Well, let's go game stats. 539 yards of total offense. We threw the ball a whole lot more than I thought we did, but half of that was just me playing around with some things. Uh... Third down looked good. Turnovers went in our way. Always helps. 
Let's go to the individual. Simmons, 10 of 15, three touchdowns. Of course, a lot of that stuff I kept it pretty simple for him. Running the ball. Here's what I want to say. Gladhard, Simmons, and Davidson, 12, 10, and 11. I'm perfectly fine with that. Good to see Gladhard have a really good game. 174 yards, three touchdowns. It was all his show today for sure. Receiving. We had five different guys get the touch the ball. Olsen. Who would have thought he would get two big uh, catches today? 30-yard 30, 30 average for both. <laughs> ah, that's funny. And Myers, good to see him do damage in the passing game. Uh, let's go here. Tackles. It was an even distribution among a lot of people. A lot of people either had one or two tackles, with Potts getting four. Okay, let's get out of here, and we'll sim the rest of the week, and fingers crossed, hopefully we will get some commitments. Now, what I can do is, let's close this. Oh, it's going to do it by itself. I was going to do the quick uh, option, but let it do its thing. I don't know who we have next. I think another, just an average team before we got to play Virginia Tech. So the schedule's fixing to heat back up again. I'd imagine Virginia Tech will be really tough because they always have a strong running game and they'll just try to wear us out. But we're going to do the same thing right back at them. We got six guys came in today to visit. I don't know if I've ever had six commit in one day. I feel like I've had six come and visit before at the same time, but never have that many commitments. I think the most commitments I've ever had in one setting was maybe four. I don't know. You play this game for so long, you forget some of those things. And look at that. All six committed. Wow. Scales, free safety. Castillo, the middle linebacker. Ward. This guy's the big pocket passer. If he gets on the field, you know I'm going to be slinging around some. If I get some receivers, that would help. We were struggling there. Speaking of, we got two good receivers, a four-star and a three-star, Hines and Harrell. Needed some depth there in the worst way. Got a little speedster, and we got a big guy. And we got another middle linebacker. This guy right here may be a defensive end down the road, and this one may be a good true middle linebacker. We'll see how that goes. But we got all six. Again, I've never done that before. I just don't remember having that many at once. That's awesome. I do not want to save just yet. We do have Arkansas State coming up. What I want to do is go to recruiting. And we got two guys left. This middle linebacker and Nick Whitaker is up for an official visit. So we're just going to go 50 across the board for each. Just do that now. We'll look at this at the beginning of the next video. Go here. And what we can do is go ahead and schedule this guy's visit for the next one, Arkansas State. And he is real big on staying close to home. So we are going to do location. And Magruder isn't ready to visit yet. We may end up getting all eight of these guys. That'd be great. Well, we're at least going to get seven. I feel pretty confident we're going to get Nick Whitaker just because he likes one of our pitches. But we got the other six players. Isn't that incredible? That's awesome. All right. Come on back. In the next Dynasty video, we will take on the Arkansas State Indians. Or at least that's what they used to be called. They're now the Red Wolves, if I'm not mistaken. It looks like they run the ball extremely well, but they're not very good at anything else. Like, they're only good at one thing. That tells me they probably have just a, a good running quarterback. Now, you remember, there's a bit of a backstory to Arkansas State. We got beat by them, what, second season? Where they just destroyed us. End of the year. It's that end of the year game where just nothing goes right. And this was the team we went up against. I could be dead wrong, but I think this was them. So this would be a good payback game. Maybe we can beat it by 40 or 50. I'd love to do that. All right, guys. I'll talk to you later.